we can have our own food, grow our own food. That's what all the health and wellness is all about. What and about. what a tie-in to our next segment. <laughs> That's right, because it is Wellness Wednesday. And as some of you are wrapping up dry January, you might also use today as a time of reflection, maybe noticing what physical or mental changes came with cutting out alcohol. This morning, we are diving deeper into that conversation of what really goes on in your brain when drinking. So of course, we cannot have a Wellness Wednesday without a visit from our friend and health and wellness coach Kira Anderson. Kira, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for having me. So this is a conversation that I myself have been reflecting on a lot about, so I'm so happy that we're gonna chat about it. But we do wanna preface this, that this is all personal to you. Mm -hmm. Yes, absolutely. Everyone's relationship with alcohol is different, mm -hmm. um, but I think it's worth talking about, yes. especially as you mentioned, coming off the heels of dry January, so. Using this time to reflect, but there's there's really no shame in any of it. But you are going to take us through some facts that maybe people might want to consider. Absolutely. Um, first things first is rather obvious, but um, cannot go without being said is how dehydrating alcohol is to our okay. body. And we know water is vitally important mm -hmm. for our brain and our body. So for if you do choose to continue to drink alcohol, which again is totally okay. Yes. Um, for every drink you have, the the best thing to do is have two glasses of water okay to per drink to help kind of pretty combat. remarkable it's right a lot it, of liquids it's, <laughs> it's a lot of liquids it's a lot of liquids but at the end of the day again if we're trying to live our best from the inside out yes and we do choose to um, engage in drinking mm -hmm. alcohol and you know, I drink my gallon, so if I need right. to get through that gallon, that's definitely something to keep in mind. Absolutely. And now this next fact, it might be hurtful maybe to some, some might be like, oh, I hate to hear that, but it's about the brain, yes. the impacts on the brain. Yes, um, as most of us know who have tried alcohol before, we mm -hmm. begin um, becoming impaired shortly after starting to drink our alcoholic beverage. Mm -hmm. There's a reason for that, right? It impairs our judgment, our thinking, um, and it only lasts for about 10 to 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. And then that's why we, we want to have yet another drink. Yes. So it's, it's at the end of the day, it's not great for us. Mm -hmm. it, it is what it is. So it's better to know than not know. Um, again, feel free to enjoy if you'd like it. Yes. But, um, it's not good for us. Th there is, there's, there's power in that knowledge, Correct. right? And what I especially like about the, when it, we're talking about the brain, I know I had been open with you um, just before the beginning of January that I was going to take a step back from alcohol. Mm -hmm. I found its influence on very much my mental health. Absolutely. That idea that um, you have people that say they have anxiety and it's real. Yes. Anxiety is real, but also just how it can, it's not going to help the depression. It's not going to help the anxiety. I know I'm one in the winter time. I really have to do all things health and wellness to keep my mood up. Yes. And so that's kind of that idea of maybe just take a step back and, and, and think about your health from that holistic approach. And then, of course, this last one might be one that people know about, maybe a little bit, what it does to your physical body. Yeah, well, again, with the dehydration, um, if you are, let's say you work out, like you and I work mm -hmm. out, we're, we're going to be much better set up if we're not drinking the alcohol. Yes. Um, it ages us, our skin, yes. our insides. It's just, it's again, it's just facing the fact that it's not healthy for us. So if yes. you really, truly do want to be the best version of yourself, maybe taking a step away or calming down a little bit on our alcohol intake. Yeah, because be it, it is going to lead to some of that damage that yes. you might see internally in your body as well. So that is, that's, we, I wish I could talk forever with you about this. Absolutely. I yeah. really, really could. Yeah. But there's a lot of non-alcohol options mm -hmm. um, that we've, the industry is absolutely booming. So why don't you take a look at your screen here for further information about the Essentials by Kira, because if you follow her on Instagram, she's constantly posting a lot of those resources and, can, and expanding the conversation because, again, this is one that I could take up the entire show truly chatting about. Um, so it's, it's, it's our own journey. We're all just trying to figure out. So thank you for kind of bringing those facts and being a light for us today. Absolutely. Thanks for having me. Uh